We're following a developing story out of Youngstown. A newborn baby killed by the family dog at just three days old. Now that dog is back home with its family after 10 days away. 27 First News reporter James Santelli is here with that new information. And Erica, I just got back from that home on Youngstown's south side. The Grimm family just took their dog Toby back from the pound today. And now we want you to meet him. Toby is a two-year-old shepherd lab mix. You can see him here with his owner, James Grimm. That's the baby's uncle. And he says when they brought baby Aiden home, Toby was happy to see him and giving him kisses. But something went wrong in the early morning on February 8th. Baby Aiden fell out of a laundry basket being used as a crib. And James describes what he says happened next. I think he was trying to like, pick the baby up and take him to my sister. But right before the ambulance came, he died. And, you know, we had to watch him die. And that was just the hardest thing I've ever been through. The Mahoning County she Deputy Coroner says Toby minutes. killed the baby when it bit the child in the head, but that it was an accident. The coroner ruling this was not a mauling or attack. And the dog was in the pound until yesterday. The county has labeled it a vicious dog, which the owner says is a label that he will fight. I asked the grandmother if she ever considered giving Toby away, not taking the dog back. You'll hear her answer tonight on First News at 11. Live in the studio, James Santelli, WKBN 27 First News. Erica.